Guys, I am back. Literally, welcome back. Welcome back. It's been like a month or two. I took a solid, yeah, month or two off because I was really focusing on TAFE and trying to graduate, which I have finally done. Um, it was a big fat shit show, most awful experience of my life, but we got there and we're absolutely done. I'm trying to get back into my filming and everything, which I'm really happy about because I didn't get to do a lot of the fun stuff that I wanted to do during this course. So I finally get back in my groove, back in the absolute vibes. Today, on today's agenda, we actually, I'm getting ready for the doctors now and then I'm going straight to the gym and then I've got my Tay fashion show tonight which is really absolutely slay should be really good we designed our mini resort wear collection so that's going to be on the absolute models today going down the runway we're off to the gym here is today's gym fit this is by far one of my favorite gym fits the v front and the scrunch bum it's giving bad bitch so everyone say good morning to grumpy he's very grumpy all the time yeah yeah i'm just gonna take you through the next few days get back onto my vlogging vibes get back into it um and if you're not following me on instagram and tiktok it's just at keely pedjevic i post more content on tiktok as well which is really fun so yeah back from the absolute doctors um it was kind of successful but basically she just said i had to go and speak to my gynecologist um about the issues that i'm experiencing um, so I have my gynecologist appointment on Friday, so I'll speak to her about my issues because there's so many of them. I'm doing a lower body workout today. I'm doing all the exercises that I would usually do, but I'm going to decrease the weight because my back is really bad today. Um, back flash, I had a really bad back injury a few years ago when I was competing in Taekwondo and it's just been fucked ever since. It's been fucked. So I'm having a bit of a flare up this week. So I'm going to do what I usually do, but I'm just going to notch the weight down really just easy weight so I don't trigger it even more. Film you might not. I say this every single time. Depends on the busyness of the gym. But I'm just going to have my pre-workout and then we're going to get it. And then we're going to get into it. <laughs> I've just done my hair and my makeup and my outfit. I filmed a get ready with me on my TikTok. If you want to go and check that out, just at Kelly Pedjavik. But it's giving a big fat slay. This is actually the dress I wore for my birthday that you never saw because I never vlogged any of it. But I was going to wear my pink heels, but it just wasn't the vibe. So this is what we went with. Feeling super cute and fancy. <laughs> morning it is a couple days after the fashion show which was amazing by the way I hope the footage I got was okay I haven't really looked at it but it seemed fine uh I got it was such a good experience it was so fun and seeing my garments on the runway was just like the best feeling ever considering my teacher literally told me it wasn't gonna happen she told me my garments were not gonna make it on the runway and I wasn't capable of graduating so a big middle finger to you it's a couple days later now 7 a.m and i've just parked at the beach so i'm gonna go for a nice beach walk i want to try and do this like at least 
once a week I just find that it makes me feel really good it gets me off my phone and I just love being out so it is currently 25 degrees at 7 a.m. so it's gonna be really hot I'll probably go for like a two-hour beach walk which should be enough time but sometimes I just get carried away do you know what I mean? like carried away and I just keep walking 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 but I'm not gonna take you with me because I don't want to be lugging around a camera but afterwards if it's really hot I might pop in the absolute water go for an absolute swim I don't know what the conditions are like but if they're okay I might absolutely pop in but yeah Put on some absolute sunscreen and then I'm gonna go for a walk and I'll see you soon. Just to be thankful that I had days full of you, you, before it went. Back home, I actually had such a nice morning. Like, I went for an hour and a half walk. It was like, it was getting really hot. So I was like, I actually can't, I actually can't handle this anymore. So I only did an hour and a half, then I came back and I went in the surf for like 20 minutes maybe just to cool off it was super nice and i've come home had some food and i've literally just been laying down and cuddling miss waffles for like five ten minutes look at her she is so fluffy so it's not like i have a lot planned for the rest of the day but i do want to like clean up my room get rid of the bad vibes it's feeling really messy it's feeling really confused and stressed um and obviously it's quite messy from when i was at tafe because when i'm really stressed like my room just turns into a pig sty so i'm just gonna clean up my room i think get rid of shit and then later this afternoon i want to go to the gym but not till later and maybe christmas shopping I don't know. I just got paid and now all my money's gonna go to Christmas shopping, which is no comment. A couple hours has passed. I was gonna do like a time lapse of me cleaning my absolute room, but how convenient that my camera ran out of battery. So I couldn't do that. But I cleaned a lot of crap out of my room. I got through one whole like bin bag, one of those massive bin bags, and that's not even half my room yet. I haven't even looked under my bed. To be honest, I'm scared, but. It is it is 2.30 and I am heading off to go to the shops, do a bit of Christmas shopping, then I'm going to go to the gym. This is the OOTD. I had to do a matching pant and shoe moment. Also, a moment for the shorts. Are you joking? These are the most flattering pair of shorts I've ever put on in my life. Also, we have a an energy drink taste test coming before the gym so let's absolute go okay absolute taste test time today we have a disorder look at that disorder raspberry flavor i bought a whole pack of these bought a whole pack of these at costco the other week and i gave half of them to my partner so we got a flavor each i'm gonna have to do this quick i cannot breathe in this car it's so hot Absolutely! It just tastes like a red, tastes exactly like a red Zupa Dupa. That's really good. That's so refreshing. Genuinely, like probably like an 8 or 9 out of 10. Anyway. it is the next day and I didn't really film a lot yesterday we just woke up super early and we went for went to the beach did some absolute paddle boarding which was super fun and then we just relaxed for the rest of the day and then we watched the new Godzilla movie last night which was actually really really good except it finished at midnight which wasn't ideal so I'm super tired today but I am actually 
about to start getting ready for my work Christmas party tonight, which is super fun and fresh. At the Surface Pavilion, I've not been there before. I don't know where to park. Don't know what's happening. Don't know what's happening, but we're just going to go with absolute flow. I also bought these two products. If you follow me on TikTok, you'll know that I posted a video the other day about my skin, how I'm really struggling with my skin at the moment. It's just super. I think maybe my barrier might be a little bit broken and I feel like I've got a lot of congestion. So these were really recommended. I got them in a twin pack off Amazon for 20 bucks. Just a cute little sample pack because I didn't want to buy like the full thing if I didn't like it. I am running a little bit late, but I just wanted to show you my outfit and my makeup. I feel like I'm getting better at my makeup day by day. It's kind of really simple, but that's what I like. This is the outfit. I think the green dress was a really good choice. I should have ironed it because it's kind of kinked from being on the coat hanger, but I don't care. So it's gone with the black shoes. I really wanted to wear my pink chunky heels, but it's at the pavilion. If you know, you know, everyone dresses really basic at the pavilion and I just didn't want to draw too much attention to myself. I'm actually going to finish the vlog there. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to follow me on TikTok. I did, I filmed Get Ready With Me on TikTok. So check that out if you want to. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.